today we are going to go over the two main types of heated tower rails. These are dry element electric heated tower rails and liquid filled heated tower rails. And we're going to cover the five key differences between these two options. The first key difference is the way that these heated tower rails heat. An electric heated tower rail heats through using an electric element which runs through the rail and heats the air inside the bars, causing the rails to heat up and warm and dry your towels. A liquid filled heated tower rail is filled with liquid and heated by an electric element. As the element heats the liquid particles, they begin to move around and heat the entire rail. Secondly, an electric element heated towel is only designed to warm and dry your towels. However, a liquid filled heated towel will add some heat to your room. It acts like a radiator. This is why liquid filled rails typically have more bars closer together to create more surface area to heat. Thirdly, a dry element electric heated tower rail will begin to be warm in around 10 minutes and reach temperature in roughly half an hour. However, a liquid filled heated tower rail will take closer to an hour to reach its optimum temperature. Fourthly, if an electric heated tower rail element was ever to fail, you would need to replace the entire rail. On a liquid filled heated tower rail, you can simply replace only the element. Lastly, as liquid filled heated tower rails are a more complex construction and are designed to add heat to your room, they are typically a more expensive investment than an electric heated tower rail. Here at Thermo Group, we offer a range of electric and liquid filled heated tower rails. So go ahead and check out our range. And as always, if you have any questions, please contact us and one of our friendly staff will be happy to assist.